Hi everybody, it's Miss Judy, Grammy Judy, whatever you want to call me, it's fine with me. I'm going to do a card for you this morning. Um, my inspiration for the design is from cardstv.blogspot.com. Uh, she has a section on her page called Kit and Caboodle. And these are sketches. She has 30 or more. I'm going to use sketch number 26 from her um, sketches today. I actually have run off the sketches and put them in a little notebook and it makes me uh, have easy access. All the sketches have the numbers, uh, the measurements for a typical A2 size card and you can adjust it to other sizes if you want. But this morning I'm going to use some Hawthorne paper from Close to My Heart. I'm going to use some of their light gray ribbon. I'm also going to use a sentiment from D1872, which is sunflower, butterfly leaves, and it has uh, three different, four different uh, sentiments on it. It also comes with the thinlets, which means that you can cut out the butter, the sunflower. I did one the other day and colored it in. You can cut out the butterfly and two of the leaf shapes so that you can have easily um, shapes to put on a card or a scrapbook layout or project that you're doing. But this is D1872, available in the catalog. I'm using a an A2 size base for my card. This is an eight and a half by 11, cut in half, five and a, four, a half for the base. This is the first layer. I'm not gonna put that on yet. I'm gonna put the pieces on this layer. So I've taken the Hawthorne and I'm following her measurements and I'm going to put the layers down on the mat. The four little pieces go on the bottom. Okay, so let's do that. Get my glue and I'm going to have a little tiny border at the top of the mat just so that color will show through. So I'm going to do the top piece and then I'm going to put one of the bottom squares on to give me a guide. Okay, right there. And then I'll attach the middle piece. And then I'm going to use the ribbon around the center because my sentiment is going to go on this circle. So I'm going to use my ribbon and I've cut it out. Um, this piece is going to go right here and I'm going to tape the back down and then my sentiment will be over here and I'll have a little bow right here. So let's finish putting these pieces on. This is a very quick, easy card to do, which I love to do. Like quick and easy. And very pretty. I like this Hawthorne pattern. It's um, reminding me of fall, which I am eagerly awaiting. It's very hot and dry in southern middle Tennessee right now. So um, we're looking forward to fall. I have my sentiment, thinking of you, on my block. And I'm going to use black. And what I do is tap, 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 twist, tap. And then I'll go over to my block. And I'm using the carrier sheet that comes with all of your stamp sets. 
this makes it more um, pliable for stamping and the stamp will come out very nice. So I'm going to attach this over here. I'm just going to use some glue and then put my little ribbon on and we are there. We are there folks. So put that right there. A piece of ribbon. And just do a little standard little knot. And trim that. Trim that side. And trim this side. Somebody was talking about mailing cards with ribbons and embellishments. I've used these little knots on lots of my cards that I've done, and I've, they've always gone through the mail with standard mailing stamps. So this goes on here, and then because it is Um, this color on the inside, I might put a piece of the gray. I might not. This is perfectly legible if you want to write with a black pen. So, now I have my card ready. I did a different one using another sheet from Hawthorne. And I put two pieces of ribbon. I popped out the Thinking of You. And I had this feeling in my mind and in my heart that these would be a uh, masculine look if you have a, a male friend who needs prayers or or needs some thoughts or is going through something then these cards tend to be uh, kind of a masculine look although it can be you know for any person that you're thinking about so I appreciate you watching the video today. You can go to Cards TV. You can look up Mary's kit and caboodle sketches, which are great. You can go to my site, judyashmore.closetomyheart.com to order any supplies, stamps, um, the inks, ribbons, embellishments, uh, and do any shopping that you want to do there. Thank you so much, guys, for watching my video today. I love talking to all of you, and I love talking to myself. Ta-ta!